Everybody knows that immunity is important. What's more important is, rather than depending only on external factors for your immunity, you have the power to bring the state of your energy balance from disruption to normal, healthy condition. This is what you could call natural healing. Although doctors say that every person has a natural healing ability, how many people do you think actually have the confidence to say, I can heal my own body on my own? The concept of creating a body condition where you can heal yourself and take preventative measures on your own is very needed in these times. We cannot live without water, nor can we live without fire. In order for us to be healthy, we need the harmonization of water and fire. If you know the principle of water up, fire down, energy circulation, you can know your own energetic condition. Water up, fire down circulation is essential to increase immunity as you recover the energy balance of your body and attain the ability to take charge of and protect your own health. Water up, fire down energy circulation is really about bringing yourself to a state of positivity and enjoyment. How can you produce this positive and enjoyable state? If you're filled with stress and worries, it's hard to have water up, fire down. What you need to do is use the functions of your brain well. You don't only need your brain for studying at school. We have emotions. There are countless emotions and, and actually, Everybody wants to live a happy and joyful life. It's just that most people mistakenly believe that a happy and joyful life is given to them through their environment. In order for me to be happy and joyful, I have to have a certain amount of money, and to do that I need a certain job, and there are so many things that you need. You're trying to satisfy all of these things, and you might end up spending all your time making all the preparations for them. Whatever my environment, because this time right now is my time, I have a right to be happy. It requires training and practice. Worry is not visible to the eye. How can we pluck out the worries that are inside of our heads? Allow me to share with you three ways that you can get rid of your worries and make water up, fire down circulation. It's quite hot right now because it's summertime. The first way is to take a shower with cold water. You're given a shock to your brain. And naturally, of course, the temperature of your head will become cooler as well. You can easily have water up energy circulation. When you're doused with cold water, it really wakes you up. It's a very simple action, but it's effective. Since the temperature of your body changes suddenly and instantaneously, it makes your brain suddenly wide awake. As the energy of your body and brain change completely in an instant, your head becomes completely empty. Our brain is like that. The second way is to do an exercise like push-ups to make yourself sweat. And then after you wash, to listen to music that you like and do some dancing. You have to change your energy first to be able to dance and listen to music. When you have too many worries, even if the music plays, you'll just turn it off. That's because the negative information takes control over you and blocks all the positive energy that would let you have water up, fire down, energy circulation. The energy balance is disrupted. That negative information is the result of what I've done in my daily life. But I can refresh or purify this information. That's how you have to think of it. Refreshing information is refreshing energy. The one who makes the state of water up, fire down circulation is none other than you yourself. Third, if you want to be more positive and create the state of water up, fire down circulation, you can use simple exercise equipment like a hand grip strengthener to exercise your hands. If you do it together with anal squeezing exercises, it's extremely effective. When you squeeze your anus, the stimulus goes directly to your brain. When you're focusing on your hands, what do you think happens with the fire energy that went up to your head? The fire energy would come back down and it goes to your hands. The cold energy that was in your lower belly, the water energy, goes up to your head. Even if you use a hand grip strengthener for just five minutes or so, you can change your energetic condition much more quickly and easily. If you know these principles, there are many exercises you can do on your own. Shake off the stress of each day, that same day, every day. And take a bit of time, even if it's just 5 or 10 minutes, to make good information for yourself. It essentially means create the state of water up, fire down, energy circulation. I hope that you set up good information and a good state of mind, a positive state, before you go to sleep. Once you've done it that way, it keeps getting easier after that, since you've done it once already. If you keep training yourself that way, you'll be able to use your brain even more effectively. I call this human technology. It's the way to utilize your brain 
and the way to become the master of your brain. You're starting to know your brain. Ah, oh, my brain is mine. But until now, various negative mentalities were acting as the master. This is what you realize through meditation. Have a better understanding of your brain. What is the condition of my brain right now? Do I have the state of water up, fire down, energy circulation? Or is it the opposite? No matter who you are, as you go through life, everyone has negative information in their brain. But how will you handle it? Actually, this is the reason I developed brain education. And it's the reason why I wrote the book, Water Up, Fire Down. Everything starts from your own mind. Your emotions are not who you are, they belong to you. If you understand water up, fire down, your many emotions, when you feel depressed, anxious, or afraid, since you are the owner and master of them, then you can change them.